Hey, back again, Jelly Space. We got a new thing here. Just recently picked up a Skywatcher Star Adventure GTI, which is one of the sought after portable tracking mounts. Uh, got it secondhand, um, but at a great price. It's just got a little bit of backlash. So we're gonna go over how to fix that backlash. It's really easy. So let's find out. All right, first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and get off of the tripod. So first we'll just go ahead and take off the counterbalance shaft and set that aside. And then next we're going to go ahead and just take it off of uh, the pier attachments. So just undo these. All right, set the tripod off to the side and we'll set it down here. So what we gotta do, and that's gonna keep falling off, so I'm gonna set that to the side. And we got to remove a few things, and it is in right ascension. So you can see just a, and even here, a little bit of play there. So we're going to take that slack out. So we're going to take off our right ascension locks. And keep in mind, they do have little plastic washers, which that just fell off the table, so I'll have to get it. like that. So set those off to the side. Next, if you have your little precision screwdriver and you're going to get an Allen bit. Um, so the one that we need is going to be two millimeters and we're going to undo the Allen right here, which is for this shaft at right ascension. So I've already undone the other side and then you can pull that shaft out. It's a little tricky. But there you go. Just pull that shaft all the way out. And then we're going to lean this this way. But you can see this gets in the way. So our elevation screw is right here. And we're going to just run that down and you'll notice that it pulls that away out of the way and then we can lean this back and forward and then we have a screw here in the corner here in the corner and then one here and here and those are 1.5 millimeter screws they're these little silver ones so I've already taken them out Next, we're just going to take this cover off and out of the way. Now, there is a circuit card down here attached to the cover. I think that we can kind of get past that. But if not, then there's a couple of Phillips screws to remove. So we'll try to just sneak by it. But here's what we're tightening up. So this, this guy right here is our tension adjustment. And you can see that slop in this worm gear, which rides along these teeth. So we'll just try to tighten that up, see if I can get in there without having to remove everything. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just remove that. So I'm gonna get my Phillips. Easy peasy, and actually the screws have kind of remained in their hole, so I'm going to leave them there. Now, let's get our Allen, and that is two millimeter, and look at that, it is like finger loose at the moment. So we're going to tighten up and try to get rid of that backlash, that side to side play. So we don't want to over tighten it. So I'm going to back it off a little bit until I have that little bit of slop. And then as I'm flexing it back and forth, I'll slowly tighten it up until it's pretty much gone. There it is right there. And now I'm going to go any tighter than that. There we go. And I can move the actual gear 
back and forth, and then again flex it to feel just like a smidge is okay, but if it's excessive, then that's where you want to fix it. So that's basically it. And this is for the right ascension, the one that's on the bottom. If you ever needed to do uh, an adjustment to um, the elevation, then it's right here. I'm sorry. Uh, I got that backwards. <laughs> that's fine. So anyway, your adjustment is right here.